Hi everyone! Today I'm going to show you what to do if you run out of rope when making square knots and macrame. I'm going to show you two different scenarios. Our first scenario is if you run out of your working ropes, so the ropes that are the ones that tie around. So as you can see, I've completely run out of rope. I can just barely make another square knot, but not really. So, what am I supposed to do in this scenario? Well, let me show you. The first thing we are going to do is take the string here on the right end and cross it over the two in the middle and then behind the string on the left. So we're forming a loop here and here. Then we are going to bring in a second string and push one end through the loop on the right. So we just push it through the loop here and we're gonna pull that through until it's even with the other side. Once it's even, we take that side that we just pushed through and we wrap it around and cross it over all the other strings. And then the string here on the right that we didn't push through, it's gonna cross over, then behind the two in the middle and through the little loop up here that we just created. And you pull that through, and then we're gonna pull the two ends tight. And if you have to adjust your string, because see how it kind of looped out here? You just pull on the ones that were already existing until it corrects itself. And then we adjust until it looks good. And there we go. And now we can continue making our square knots. When you turn your project around, you'll have those ends that you had run out of earlier kind of hanging all over the place. And so to deal with these, all we do is we loosely pull out the back-sided loops and push them through. You're gonna wanna push them through a couple to make sure that they're secure. like that and then you can go and you can trim your ends a bit and then I recommend taping because as you can see my string has frayed and unraveled a bit so after you trim it to your desired length you're just gonna tape it to deal with that and then you have perfectly hidden ropes and that's all you do in my second scenario of running out of rope when making square knots I'm going to show you how to fix the problem if you run out of the ropes in the center. So the ropes that everything else gets tied around. In this example, I was doing alternating square knots and I ran out right in time for my third row. And so how do I fix this problem? We're going to bring in another rope as we did in the last scenario. And it's just going to wrap around the two ropes that we ran out of, so the ones that were in the middle, and we just kind of hold it together to form the new ropes, and then we make a square knot as we would before. So we take the string next to it, fold it over those two, the other rope then goes over behind the two in the middle, through the loop, and we pull it tight. It's gonna look a little messy at first, but we'll fix that. So we finish our square knot then. Pull that tight, and we're just going to kind of adjust all the ropes until they look fairly hidden. Just like that. And now we can go back and finish the pattern we were making. Just like that. 
And so then again, you will turn the project around to tuck in the ends that are kind of hanging down here. You'll want to trim them again and just tuck them in like I showed you before. I hope you found this video helpful if you ever find yourself in the unwanted surprise of running out of rope in the middle of your macrame projects. And thank you so much for watching.